hello everyone welcome to the channel in this video i'm going to show you how to remove poison from aloe vera plant this poison is not poison so to say but everybody consider it most people consider it as poisonous but it's not the poison part of aloe vera plant is called aloein sap it's a sap okay that is at the is the end of this okay basically when you cut the aloe vera right the sap should be allowed to drain out first it's a very bitter sap it's not toxic though so the sap is called halloween it's not toxic but the the problem with it is that it's very bitter and it can cause stomach discomfort for some people so what you want to do before you make your aloe vera gel or before you use your aloe vera is to make sure you get rid of that sap so how do we get rid of this uh, non-toxic but bitter sap is they call it poison but it's not poisonous uh, scientifically you can poison you can't say it's poisonous but it's bitter and it can cause stomach uh, upset so what you want to do is take a sharp knife okay and cut off this edge you need a sharp knife to do this cut off the sedge whatever is coming out here first should be will be the sap okay this will be the sap so we want to get rid of that sap first before you do anything. A lot of people buy aloe vera gel, aloe vera uh, stem, and they always, you know, <coughs> go ahead and use it without removing the sap. So what you do after cutting off that uh, edge, okay, this do not use, you have to get rid of it. So after cutting off that white part at the end, you're going to stand it upright, okay, in a container. You're going to allow the sap to come out if you give it around five to eight minutes the sap will come out okay you don't need to do anything you don't need to fought, uh, to bother about squeezing it what you can do is that you can rinse it a bit with water okay rinse that head with water okay the first thing that come out is the sap okay it's very bitter it's not good it causes stomach discomfort that's why a lot of people refer to it as poisonous but it's not poisonous but it's very very bitter so rinse it with water throw away that water okay you notice that water the, the the sap is green usually aloe vera is white right but it's the bitter sap which is called alo alohin a-l-o-i-n is very bitter so it's the green part that will first come out. So what I always tell uh, my clients and my friends to do is to first rinse it out. So the first part when we rinse out, we got the light uh, green color. The f second time when you rinse it out, you you'll get a clear color. So then what you go you're going to do, you're going to have to do is just stand it upright in a clean container like that. So let's allow excess sap to come out okay five to eight minutes is uh enough so i'm going to show you the sap and cl uh, closely now this is the sap see that green thing okay is the sap it's very very bitter you don't really you don't want that to come near your mouth or even your body at all it's after a while it's going to dry out and you're good to go now you can ask me why do i want to waste this part what you can do is yeah let's cut off this why we always cut this off is that this doesn't have much of a gel while we align our the halloween to dry off from the rest of the plant i'm going to show you this why would you have to cut this off when you cut this part you need a sharp knife the gel that is inside it okay it's not that valuable it's not the nutrient here is not that much but you can still make use with it but anything further here is not that valuable okay it doesn't have much right so we're going to allow it to stir uh, to rest and that's how you first thing you do before you make your aloe vera gel okay so always keep that in mind i know a lot of people have been uh, doing videos without showing you how to remove that stuff now that you know from our channel make sure you always remove that sap that bitter halloween okay 
halloween before you do it so we're going to wait for five to ten minutes so i'm going to use this to make another video okay of how to make your own aloe vera gel at home aloe vera gel for hair care and for face care so thank you so much for watching this is how you remove so after five to eight minutes you are good to go so after five to eight minutes you know what you're going to do just do me a favor take that okay and rinse it out more that sap is soluble in water okay but because it's bitter it's really useless in you so make sure you rinse it in water but do not rinse it in uh, warm water no don't regular water is what you should use to rinse it so let it stay in there again let it stay there again for another five minutes so after that you're going to take it out okay and you're just going to make sure you dry it before making your gel so in my next video we're going to use this okay to make a very powerful and very useful gel so i'm going to show you the best way to cut your aloe vera and uh, the next step to follow thank you so much everyone for watching if you want to learn more on how to make or use aloe vera for skincare products uh, this is a channel for you so click that subscribe button and the notification icon to be notified when i upload my next video thanks for watching